I'm down. I'm under it. No! Hello, fellow island riders. Glad to have you along for the adventure again, as always. Today, we're picking it up on the side of the road in the morning. <laughs> Nothing too crazy yet, but uh, I have a feeling crazy is in store. <laughs> Me and Brandon got a lead up west about a new ATV trail that's opened up. However, we have no idea where it is or how it goes through or what's involved with it whatsoever. So we uh, checked in with Cole and my buddy Dylan and his dad and they live right next to one of the uh, drop-in points. So today they're going to Sherpa us, Sherpa us through that trail and uh, hopefully we're going to be able to find out where it goes and kind of enjoy it a bit. Uh, but before that, um, it isn't too too early but it's early enough for me to want some more coffee. So I'm going to go up to getting ourselves squared away towards uh, Tyne Valley, which is where we're headed. But, uh, but first I'm going to get some coffee. Holy smokes. Mmm. Coffee, 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 coffee. I'm going to wait here for Brandon to get in and then we'll We'll head her up the road, head her up west then. Till then, folks. All right, so we are here in Tyne Valley. Finally made it up west. That was a bit of a ride, for sure. Um, so today, as I mentioned, we are going to be hitting the Evangeline Club. I think I called it the, the Country Valley Club or the Country ATV Trail. Trail. Anyway, I got it wrong. Dylan knows. <laughs> because he's our Sherpa here today. So he's going to be running me and Brandon through the trails. Again, Brandon's on his DR650. I got the KLR650. Anyway, all three bikes are ready to rock. So I guess this is where we say let's pick it up if, and hope we don't put it down. So from what Dylan tells us, the trail pretty much picks up right here to the right quite quick but he said this section goes on for like ever you can be on this for like three hours it's crazy so we'll have to see how far we get on it today um one thing is is we got some serious rain last night and i was hoping that yeah okay he's pointing to the right i was hoping that uh you know we were going to kind of escape some of the mud bogs but he says there's ways to get around but we'll have to see. Already I'm not doing great. <laughs> Here we go. Thighs are up so we can think. Oh, the power line cut. The plot thickens. The power line cut, AKA the hydro cut. That's how you know you got a good trail on your hands. Oh. Yeah, look at that mud. So Brandon has the advantage today. You're rocking the, the D606s, super fresh. <laughs> oh man, I'd love me a good power line cut. However, here's one thing I've learned about these. There's usually a swamp in the middle of them. <laughs> but Dylan's got a nice winch, so we shouldn't have too much of a problem there. Dylan's just loving it. <laughs> so yeah, this is absolutely 110% new route unlocked. Um, did some work to get here. It was about a, I'd say it's about an hour ride to get out here. Not too, too bad. That's the beauty of the dual sport slash ADV bike. Ride to where the trail begins. And that's where your adventure begins. But with any new route unlock, we're really taking it easy. We're not ripping through these. I don't even know if you could, man. Holy, probably. But I always like coming through here on new ATV trails with a Sherpa. Like, so Dylan is, is our man, man, right now. 
the super Sherpa. <laughs> so what he's gonna do is not only show us where he's where we're supposed to go, but if we run into riders ahead of us, he's gonna let them know we're coming and he's gonna slow us down to make sure we don't have any issues. Because we don't know where the, uh, the congested parts are and he does. Oh, boys. Big left here. So much wood section to this trail, and the trails are like so beauty. I love it. <laughs> All right, she's a little greasy here. Whoa, 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 almost lost her. Not too bad though. Slime, more so bog. Brandon's having no trouble. I think this is going to be my last trail ride before switching over the tires. I got it. There he goes. <laughs> All right, so it looks like we go right through the road here. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. No way. I think she goes to the right, Botskis. Closed, eh? Get off the road. I think there's a detour this way. spotted something. Oh, I think I know what he's doing. I think he's cutting on to the second. Yeah, there it is. See the sign? Nice. Good signage. Yeah, they don't have anything on the Facebook page with that being closed. They probably did because it got too soupy, I bet. But it's really dry out. You'd think it'd be. So yeah, all this does is like, this is actually part of the like they actually got them officially on the like that ATVs are allowed to drive on these. Oh, roads. that's right. That's that on-road partner program or whatever. Yeah. So this is the the Taddy Road, and that goes this goes all the way to Wellington. So we'll just take this all the way through, and then we can take a left. So we're basically just skipping all of this woods here. Yeah, yeah. And we'll just take a left onto the Hackman Attack Road, and then up through Nine Valley. There we go, we're back on her now. I'll let you go ahead, Brandon. Whoa, yep. No, I almost... I'm gonna follow your line, you look like you got the dryer side. I had the white grass try to take me out. Oh, it wants it. Oh yeah, we're getting into her now. Wait till you get through her. How'd you like that? I'm down. I'm under it. No! Oh. I'm under it. Not anymore. Get the fuel off here. Oh, nope. That's the end of that. 
<laughs> All right. Yeah, yeah, I got her. Give me a second to check her over here. Uh-oh. Oh, no, my saddlebags. <laughs> They're done. Yeah, that does it. One more for good luck, maybe. Fuck yeah, boys. All right. No, not yet. Day's young, boys. All right. That old log got me. Bugger. Yeah, the old back tire just slid right along the side of that log and fell and got right underneath, right over top of my leg. <laughs> oh there, Island Riders, you haven't seen me crash all season long? <laughs> Not really a crash, that was more of a controlled laydown. <laughs> all in good fun. Oh, here we go. Take the rut, I think. <laughs> right side or left side, you think? Roger. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm just walking her. Roger, holy smokes, say yeah, right side. Oh, now she wants to be on the left. No pox. Right side. Buy the gummy. Holy smokes, it's a slow going one. Four Shinkos. <laughs> oh, oh my god. We need new tires, folks. <laughs> we should have been able to just bloom right up that, blast right up that one. <laughs> Holy. There we go. Take some of that mud off into my face. <laughs> good job, good job. Oh, big one. Man, I was wondering why she couldn't make it up over the hills. I was like, well, the tires are not great anymore. <laughs> Maybe we do this, you know, every year, right before I change tires. <laughs> the end of life challenge is what we'll do. That's a good one for you folks. Do your end of life challenge. Are your tires at the end of her? Take her in through the mud. <laughs> oh man, so now while we have a bit of a, a lull in the craziness of the trail, it's a good thing to talk about what to watch for when you're riding through with the Sherpa. Now, if you've got a four-wheeler, it's a little bit harder to do this, but you can get an idea. But if you're with a dual sport or an ADV bike, watch their line and ask them if you got the comms on. Like every once in a while, you probably notice and I say, ask him, Brandon, like, what's the good line? Is it right or left? And he'll like, he'll let me know. Wow, almost, almost. Yeah. So I'm tracking 
you know, Brandon's line through here and I'm seeing which one he's taking and seeing how well he does with it. So if I see it take it good and he's kind of having a fun time, then I'm going to go for it. If I see him almost beefer, then I'm probably going to take the other line. <laughs> There. Wow, look at all that field. Potatoes for days. Clean up the boots a bit. Tree branches. Oh. Whoa, almost got me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Wowzers. That was wild. <laughs> Time change tires. <laughs> <laughs> All right, where to now, buddy? Tyne Valley. Tyne Valley. Back to Tyne Valley, eh? Right on. I like it. <laughs>